Hello everyone, this is Eric from Team 1010W and today I'm going to show you guys our team's odometry testing. So odometry is basically a way to uh, keep track of the robot on the field at any given point. So it returns, for example, the X and Y value uh, on the robot uh, on the uh, on the plane. So our robot has two tracking wheels, one over here. Right, so for uh, vertical movements and one over here under our intake for uh, lateral movements. And uh, our tracking center is approximately there. And I've positioned that point to zero, zero on the field. So using two tape measures. Right, so now this point is zero, zero. And yeah, I'll just be driving around and uh, see if the values given by the tracking wheels are accurate compared to the actual values. All right. Let me pull up the program. That was the catapult. Uh, let's, uh, let's just drive around. All right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so I'll stop there. All right, so the tracking center is like over here. So if I match that, that would uh, that will be like seventeen or sixteen. I'm just eyeballing it at this point, and that will be the y value. And if we get the x value, that will be like four or five, five or six, I guess. So five or six for x and around 17 for a Y. Okay, let's see how close I got. Uh, all right, so if you can see the IX value, oh, that's pretty close actually. So this gives like around four and that gives around 17. Yeah, that was, uh, that was very close. I mean, the surface also plays a role because this is Carpet and actual Vex tiles are like foam, right? So that plays a role. And uh, yeah, uh, the odometry was pretty accurate. And if you guys wanted me to do uh, an explanation of our code, uh, leave your comments below. I'll see you guys next time.